Hello guys, this is Vaish. So uh, this is a video series uh, which uh, students have been requesting me since long time. And uh, this was already done uh, in a different foundation series and all. But again, how to prepare uh, different subjects for UPSC. So that specific uh, detailing they wanted. So I thought I'll make short, short videos. And the first episode will be science and tech. Okay, so science and tech uh, we'll cover in this video in detail. Okay, like what you have to prepare and how you have to prepare and all. And this video will be valid for every aspirant who is preparing from this year onwards, 2023, 24, up to 30. Because these things are not going to change. Even if they change syllabus or anything, the basics of how science and tech has to be prepared, that will not change. Okay, so this again, as I told, this is going to be that one short, one single video which you need and you won't have any other doubts. Okay, you will not have any any doubts if you actually watch our foundation series. series. Now, just because 24, 25 uh, students were asking, okay, the 2024 aspirants, I'm just focusing on subject wise and doing short videos for that. So, what shall we discuss in this video? The agenda, we'll see the weightage in exam, meaning the science and tech, what is the weightage in exam, then the syllabus breakdown in detail, and then glimpse of previous year question paper, that is the 2022 is the latest prelims paper. So I'll just show you the glimpse. It's not like sitting and discussing the paper because that we have a separate playlist already. Okay. And then the sources to prepare and how to prepare from those sources. And then how YCIS can help you in specific for this subject. Okay. Because you know, in general, how we do and what, uh, what the things are, but this is uh, science specific. So like this, if I do for every single subject, and if you have 10, 15 videos in a single playlist, I'm sure then you don't have to worry about your preparation at all. Okay. At home, you can sit and do this very easily, every subject. Okay. So that is what I'm aiming for. So this, as I told, will be part of a big playlist. The playlist name will be how to prepare. Okay. So when next time onwards, you type like YCIS, how to prepare, and then put whatever subject you want, a video will come. Okay. So like art and culture will come modern history, medieval history, ancient history, and then there is geography is there, environment, uh, science and tech, which I'm doing now, current affairs, uh, CSAT, polity, economy, and much more. Okay. Like this for mains papers, CS1, 2, 3, 4, and all, already we have videos, detailed videos are there. So I'm just trying to increase that playlist and then uh, take into consideration the latest happenings, the latest 2022 and all what happened in the exam. Based on that, I have just uh, uh, improved it. Okay. Improvisation of the existing uh, foundation. Okay. Because this is what has changed the lives of many aspirants, including uh, like 2021, 22, and all our students are going and clearing each and every stage. Okay. Like this time uh, interview also, few students are giving the interview. So we are very hopeful of them so that is why i'm telling we want more students to clear and that is why we are designing these kind of courses okay so again as i am telling if you are a new student if you have heard vaishayas for the first time simply type vaishayas foundation playlist on youtube and you will get like this English medium also, Hindi medium also, two separate playlists will come. English is the most detailed one which I have done and in Hindi also has everything but because it's Hindi medium and we don't have Hindi medium lectures and all, we have given it in a generic way. Okay, it's not like we cannot tell like, okay, watch that playlist or this playlist because we don't have Hindi medium thing as of now. But English will have the entire detailing of the uh, UPSC uh, preparation. Okay. So now, first uh, agenda part I told do it is weightage of science. So how important is science? Whether I can skip science and go to the prelims and mains and still I'll clear or what is the thing? Okay, that you can decide based on the factual things which I give you. Okay, so prelims, you know, around uh, out of the 100 questions, that is 200 marks you have to give, around 10 to 15 questions comes. That's about science science specific okay it can be current affairs science it can be static science but 10 to 15 question comes and then that means the marks is how much 20 to 30 marks out of 200 so now you will think okay i'll skip this and remaining still 170 marks is there out of which i can score okay but problem is there again in that 170 there is uh, portions like ancient history there is this uh, tough economics sometimes it comes and some uh, tough polity question comes so you have it's not like that 170 is going to be very easy for you. So you have to prepare science for sure. But this is the prelims I am telling. Now for mains, it is even more important because in uh, mains GS3 paper, where you have economics, uh, environment, uh, the internal security, disaster management, and that science and tech is also a very important portion out of which 50 to 70 marks comes, meaning at least uh, four to uh, five questions I can tell uh, will come in this uh, science and tech, okay, from this science and tech, meaning now you know how this 250 marks they are formed is they have uh, 10, uh, 10 marker question and they have 10, uh, 15 marker question. Okay, so it is like 100 plus 150, uh, total 250 marks. So from this also, two questions will be science and tech. From this also, two questions will be science and tech. So you have 20 plus uh, 30. Okay, 20 marks from the first one and 30 marks. So 50 marks minimum is going to anyway come. Okay, and more 70 I told because sometimes environment questions can be interlinked with science. Okay. Like they will tell how can uh, the plastic industry or the uh, nanoparticle uh, technology that can affect the environment. So they'll ask a science plus environment mix question, okay, where you need science information also. That is how it goes to up to 70, 75 marks out of 250, which is a big weightage. That is why science becomes very important for you. Okay, so this, if you see the prelims uh, question count from 2017 to 22, I've taken, I can show even, even older ones and all, but I'm just taking last five, six years. So if you see here, it is like nine questions which came in 2017, then it became 10 questions, then it again became nine questions. 
questions. Here it is around 11 questions. Here it is 13 questions and the latest 2022. Okay, of which questions I'll show you in this video. There are 13, sorry, 15 questions are there. Okay, 15 questions came in 2022 where I, as I told, 12 questions are science specific and then remaining three are science plus environment mix. Okay, so that I will show you here in this video. So this is why I'm telling it's not like two questions or three questions. It's around 10 to 15 questions and it becomes very, very vital for your uh, cut off okay to reach your cutoff okay so this is the weightage of science now the syllabus breakdown so that i'll do in two ways what how upsc has given and what we can do for you to make it much more easier for you okay so syllabus breakdown in syllabus prelims actually nothing is mentioned okay nothing much just one word of science is mentioned which i'll show you now and it means there are some keywords so mixing of these two i'll give you how to understand the science thing okay so this is the prelim syllabus official syllabus of 2022 pdf if you take even in 2023 notification which will come this february this will be same only nothing is going to change okay so if you see two words are related to science one is current event and one is general science okay and that can be national and international okay so current affairs part of uh, science also you have to do current affairs of everything actually you have to do but we we are talking about science in this video okay so current affairs and general science and from this you actually cannot understand what to prepare okay we will definitely not know what to prepare so now we'll go and take the main syllabus in the same pdf there'll be main syllabus where some details are given so science and technology development and their applications then everyday life how it affects you then achievements of indians specifically in science and technology then indigenization of technology developing new technology then awareness in different field which is it space computers if you are a very serious aspirant i expect you to make notes okay please make notes of what i am telling take a separate page for science and tech and uh, write it down okay so it space computer robotics nanotechnology biotechnology and ipr that is intellectual property rights so this much okay this much is the keywords which upsc has given you but i am telling out of this all, uh, other than this also many question comes okay like your health disease energy there are many things so that is what now this is as i told this upsc syllabus breakdown which any coaching institute will take and give you okay so now let it make it like a micro uh, breaking down okay micro syllabus i'll tell you which is in vaishaya's uh, style of teaching you so this first i'll list down the keywords which upsc has given these are the keywords which upsc has given which i showed you in the previous slide okay this much they have given this up to this okay now health medicine vaccine and energy i have added by myself okay because questions are coming from that area after the covid thing started now this also is not enough because this is the maximum which every coaching institute i know when they give this uh, test syllabus or how to prepare this week this is what they give you but now based on my analysis of the last five to ten years of question papers of upsc i will tell you what exactly to prepare okay so in general science the topics okay you know science means what physics chemistry biology right physics chemistry biology that doesn't mean you take up the ncrts and study because you don't need to study so what you have to study okay so in basic biochemistry physics i'll tell you one by one so in biology you have to know this basic thing like what is the cell and that also plant cell and animal cell about which questions are coming last few years and then cell little bit you extend means what it is the mitochondria dna rna that kind of things this is the topics and this is the only topics from which questions will come so if you just prepare one one para or half a page of notes for each of these topic which i give you in the screen please make notes okay if you prepare that is sufficient your own handmade notes will be sufficient for you for even if you fail you can use it the next year also or if you pass you can use it for the mains also that's why i'm telling these keywords you have to have half a page of notes which actually i will also try to prepare but that will be later maybe a paid course or something okay and we have free videos that i'll talk about in the later half of this video so this is the biology part now if you take the chemistry part atom element okay element means anything like sodium potassium uh, lithium any any that kind of thing okay then compound different from compounds which are about aluminum compounds are there phosphorus compounds are there then about water specific questions are coming like what is uh, specific heat of water or anything like uh, what is dissolving in water that kind of things then there is this mirror light and em spectrum that is electromagnetic spectrum part okay where light again this if you see reflection refraction that part okay mirrors are there different type concave con convex is there light many type of questions are there light even led lamp the street lights sodium lamp Lamp. these are the type of questions which came in the last two three years okay then em spectrum if you see it's like a you know infrared rays bluetooth rays then this uh, this thing is there uh, sorry x-rays gamma rays alpha rays beta rays that is the thing which comes in spectrum okay then radio frequency in radio frequency you know this am and fm is there okay how it is different from each other then tv and computer tv if you see the lcd screen led screen uh, cctv okay the, those are the things which are recently coming then computing i'll show in the next section also computing then ac dc of electricity what is the basic difference only basic four five differential points only you need you don't need any detailing of that okay because in mains i don't see such questions only in prelims it comes and then chemistry again litmus test and some things are there which is not very important i think 10 15 years back they used to ask about this okay so this is called general science 
Okay, now about applications, you will take different types of new technologies and new things which are happening, which is like cloud computing, quantum computing, about which 2022 question came, wireless and VLC, this again 2022 question came, so which I'll show you now. Okay, so in that it's a LAN and WAN, okay, like a local area network, wide area network, then internet of things, which at least three questions came in the last five years, then there is 5G about which question came, then all the news item, okay, this we cannot like tell you like what from the news can be picked up, very, very strange things are coming and I'll show you that questions also today. And then emerging technology inventions the future and the features of like how is 3g different from 4g how is 4g different from 5g okay so whether after that again new something will come okay ar vr and all is there augmented reality virtual reality that kind of things that is the application part so every keyword you see you need to have a one paragraph understanding like what is the definition of it what is the example of it and what is the difference of it this much only you have to prepare of all these topics okay for which as i'm telling many free videos i've already done now achievements especially Indian people's achievement. Okay, the awards which Indians have got in various science summit or forum, Nobel Prize, anything. Okay, patents which we have on different products, GI tag which we have on different products, the Niti Aayog, whether they are doing any new missions, new reports published, then the ministries of science and technology, what they are doing, ministry of earth science, what they are doing, then the schemes. Okay, the schemes are very important for even uh, national education policy, the new thing which is coming. We are trying to make more science schemes available, more fellowship schemes available, prime minister fellowship scheme, Ramanuja scheme, there are many things. So this kind of science related things you have to study. Then there is indigenization. So indigenization means India themselves doing maybe digital India, Indian innovations, India's Gagan and Navik, which is based on the GPS type. Then the digital India program, Indian portals, okay, which last year a detailed question came about COVID portal, the uh, Aroge Setu portal, okay. So like that many uh, things are there which are in news. So it will get merged with your uh, uh, current affair preparation as well. Okay, you don't have to do specific preparation. Then exports, okay, like whether we export certain uh, rockets or maybe people are buying missiles from us. So these kind of things. Okay. Then there is the IT computer and software in which there is the cyber security, which is a very important topic for prelims and mains. Then supercomputers, we are developing one after the other. We are competing with other countries. Japan have great supercomputers. USA has great supercomputer. Then these basic simple terms like RAM, ROM, flop, uh, floppy. Floppy is in use this year because Japan is trying to completely eradicate floppy system. Then uh, GB, MB, 3G, 4G, 5G, LED augmented reality virtual reality then web 2022 question came on web uh, 2.0 and web 3.0 then portals as i told then bodies and different summits which happen science plus environment summits okay and whether india is hosting any summits then robotics and nano so drones you know repeated questions are coming then nanoparticles 2022 question then how nanoparticle interact and cause environment issue is a 2022 question then summits as i told and current affairs basic definition and as, as i told one page notes on every single word you see on screen if you prepare okay it'll take maximum uh, three days to seven days effort one week effort if you do it's your lifetime notes okay and you don't depend on these unwanted telegram notes and junk and all they're simply copy pasting from the uh, branded institutes and giving you and it will not be complete but if you do based on your research on previous year questions and foundation videos like this you will have the best notes in the country okay and i'm trying to make that only i'm trying to make you the best aspirant in the country and you should be able to compete with those people going for lakhs of rupees of coaching okay that is my mission in this entire channel which i have tried since the last three four years so now ipr and biotech okay so here agriculture concept will come last year mains question tkdl traditional knowledge digital library then gm crops agri tech in agriculture what technology you can use different textiles are there okay technical textiles also are there fibers and plastics is the most favorite topic now for upsc even in csat passages are coming based on this so this is like repeatedly questions coming and tough questions are coming okay which you cannot solve actually which you cannot prepare also so that is one area of concern then environmental issues current affairs and gene editing tool crispr cas9 and all was like three years back repeatedly they asked now they stopped this okay now they have shifted more towards this uh, virus and bacteria and all okay then space defense and nuclear so space defense if you see basic what are the eight planets existing whether they have a satellite or natural moon for them or an artificial moon for them then the different celestial body basic names like sun moon langrage point earth uh, distance between each Okay, not like I'm not telling the value of like how much kilometers or how much millions, but the different words which you see, like what is a light year, what is a time and space, what is uh, uh, the rings around Saturn. Okay, so uh, whether anything like asteroid is coming and hitting us, what is basic things, what is asteroid, what is meteor, what is meteorite, and all these are there in your class six standard itself. Class six standard geography, you will get answers for all these things. Okay, then you have to do the news, obviously, where you'll have different space missions, India's and uh, foreign also. Okay, because USA's uh, Jupiter mission and all the detailed mains question came once in. Uh, UPSC. Then the basic difference between what is SLV, PSLV, GSLV, which we have done free videos. Okay, most of these there are free videos in my channel itself. Okay, then the past.
past, present, future. Okay, everything you have to do know about uh, space missions. Then there is fission and fusion of nuclear. Okay, basic difference and whether we have any fission projects, whether we have any fusion projects, whether we are collaborating with countries, that kind of things, or whether any nuclear disaster has happened recently, that kind of things. Okay, then scientists. Scientists, if you see. Uh, Bose, uh, Satyananath Bose, Swaminathan, Vishweshwaraya, these are the people about which mains question came. Okay, that's why I just mentioned their names. But you have to know more people. Okay, like C.V. Raman, you take, Albert Einstein, you take, Isaac Newton, you take. We have to know the basic things, what they did. And the latest uh, Nobel Prize winners of physics, chemistry, biology, medicine. That things, if you do, it will be good for you. Okay, because from that, there is a chance that any year question can come. Also, the basics of what is Nobel Prize? How is the Nobel Prize given? Who is giving it? What is the cash price? What is the price money? Or how often it is given? How many people can get? maximum to uh, Nobel Prize in one year. That kind of many things are there, whether Indians have got it. Okay, such things. This is up to the UPSC syllabus breakdown, which I gave the maximum detail. Now, the latest one which is trending is health, medicine and vaccine, in which you have to know about bacteria, fungi, virus, protozoa, that kind of thing. Then COVID, tuberculosis, surgery is happening. Okay, cataract disease, heart disease and uh, HIV. These are the things from which questions have come. Then RNA, DNA, mRNA and the, this year trending is RNA, I. So, about these questions are expected. Okay, then vitamins and vitamin deficiency, what it can cause. Then various diseases, as I told, HIV, HPV. Okay, cholera is uh, spreading across the world now. Cholera question is expected okay then the different cures if it anything is invented or something is discovered that kind of things okay this is the health medicine vaccine area and different bodies are there okay like who is the india's regulator who gives approval for different vaccine who is the one funding it whether indian government is uh, providing thing or private thing is doing that kind of things okay then energy which is a coalition with environment topic also okay where electric vehicles will come clean and new and renewable energy will come india statistics what it is whether we are in line with the sdg goals and paris summit world statistics how it is whether world is giving proper funding to the developing countries then uh, climate change summits targets so as i told you are slowly merging towards environment this happens with every subject of upsc and that's the beauty about upsc when you study science you slowly re start relating with other topics okay when you study environment you start relating with geography when you study geography you re start relating with sometimes maps and from maps you relate to history from history you related to polity okay like that it keeps going everything is interlinked upsc is the only exam where this linkage you will get it okay and it's very very interesting to study you clear the exam you fail the exam you will become a very knowledgeable standard person i can tell Okay, very good person you will become after UPSC preparation. Okay, so this is about the syllabus breakdown. So now previous year paper is the section and one more section is there and I will wind up this video. So I'll show you one question first, okay, which is like 2021 versus 22. I wanted to show a comparison because I always tell you one thing, the wrong answer of one year will be the right answer or the important topic for the next year. Okay, this always happens, and, but the students don't take it seriously. They just by heart the answer. For example, here, this uh, bisphenol uh, or bisphenol, this one, a question came like it is in the, used in the manufacture of which of the following kind of plastic. First thing is nobody will prepare these kind of plastics and all. So it was a tough question. Okay, like polyethylene, polycarbonate, polyethylene terephthalate, polyvinyl chloride, that is your PVC pipe and all. So this four things were given. And so obviously a person who don't read newspapers, because this came in the news, okay, you do, don't read newspaper. And even if you read, maybe you don't know this much detailing. Okay, it's very difficult. You cannot directly get this like, okay, this is used for this manufacturing. It is written nowhere in any textbook. Okay, so this was a difficult question. You could have skipped it. But when you skip it, and finally when the answer key came, answer is uh, polycarbonate. Okay, this is fine. This is okay. So students, what they did is okay. Bisphenol is used in the manufacture of polycarbonate. Done. This is your preparation. You did not read what is polyethylene. You did not read what is this PET, that is polyethylene terephthalate. You did not go back and read PVC. But UPSC will pick these topics and ask you in the next year. Okay, this happens every year. Year after year, you take any subjects, history, geography, polity, anything. The wrong answers of that last year will definitely have a question as the right answer or the main topic in the next year. Okay, so 2022. They directly asked with reference to polyethylene terephthalate and they wanted to know the basics about it, whether it can be recycled, whether it can be used to store alcoholic beverages, whether they uh, let out greenhouse gas emissions, whether they can be blended with cotton fiber. So it's like very basic thing they asked. So that was actually UPSC's uh, trick of checking whether are you a serious aspirant who checked last year's question paper and came did you prepare that topic and came okay and 99 percent of you will not have done it and tell like this is a very difficult question but this is one of the easiest question because options also were like only two you have to pick up so if you eliminate any one or two you will get the answer okay so i'm not discussing answers here okay this one i told you just to tell you like this was the right, right answer here and the wrong answer is the uh, next important uh, topic for next year. Okay, and this happens again and again. Every question will come. Now expect a question on polyvinyl chloride. Okay, expect a question on polyethylene. It will come. Next year it will come. Okay, so please prepare like this. So this is the comparison. Okay, now I'll show you 2022's all the questions which came, 15 questions which came last year. Okay, 
so now till now if you have liked okay because i hope this is helping you it is interesting if it is okay please try to hit subscribe okay because without your like comment subscription and all i i don't feel like putting this much effort okay we are putting a lot of effort to gather all this information so please hit that subscribe button we are not asking you any fee for this just hit that subscribe and take us to different different milestones so that i can every day when i wake up i see a like okay 100 more people have subscribed i feel okay let's make two three more videos okay when we see that okay nothing nobody has subscribed there is no like and comment there is no uh, thanksness or there's there's nothing for what we did yesterday we you will think we won't feel like putting that much effort the next day okay so please try to support us and stay in touch in all these places okay in youtube facebook instagram i'm posting a lot of things so please hit the like and comment and subscribe for this video now itself and then okay we shall proceed now so previous year paper 2022 as i told 15 question came one is this uh, question this uh, pet okay the polyethylene terephthalate which again all these things in a separate playlist i will discuss okay i'll discuss this thing why each statement is correct or wrong and what is the answer i'll tell you this episode i'm just showing you a glimpse of the questions so that you can connect with the syllabus breakdown which i did in the previous uh, slide okay each question when you see you will see that okay this is exactly what was mentioned in the previous syllabus breakdown okay so now if you see this one cctv closed circuit television okay most people did not know that okay this is cctv then radio frequency and wlan so about this which are the following a short range device so what is short range what is long range this is a repeated question okay last few years back it was like about bluetooth and infrared they used to ask now they are asking other things so whatever are the things which you generally use this is the, what is mentioned in syllabus application daily life you are using this in daily life so they asked a question on this okay so this is the uh, second question which came in 2022 then if you see dna barcoding so dna barcoding can whether it can be used for age of a plant and animal distinguish among species and identify undesirable thing and here if you see there is no option called 1 2 3 earlier science questions were very easy always 1 2 3 1 2 3 you can do but here you just have to eliminate one statement and you will get the answer okay because age and all you cannot tell by dna because dna you are 5 years old or you are 100 years old your dna will be same only so you can eliminate one there itself okay as i told i am not going to discuss detail but like this see now 3 and 2 3 and only so 3 is definitely correct you didn't even read but you know and obviously it will help to distinguish among species so 2 is also correct answer is 2 and 3 done so this much easy questions are coming but you have to know that you have to prepare dna okay that too i am telling just understand what is dna for this you did not have to know very detailing like okay dna how it looks like it has a helix structure it has a double strand you don't need all those things you just need to know that dna helps you in distinguishing between species and you got the answer okay so that basic knowledge is what you need to know then this is about like uh, cultivators of fungi okay and cockroach crab spider okay if you know the answer you can tell in comment section i'll anyway discuss in the 2022 playlist okay so this if you see this is an environment plus science mix you can tell then this is like qubit qubit is quantum computing everybody knows so this if you see this again repetition is coming meaning in mains also quantum computing question came okay then if you see now you studied this qubit quantum computing but you will skip cloud services you will skip vlc you will skip wireless communication and next year you will see a detailed question on vlc and then tell like sir it's a difficult question i did not prepare you did not prepare because you ignored the wrong answer here you have to prepare all these wrong answers also okay then here b cell and t cell which was a direct question from vishay st series also okay it's about your immunity so uh, it will help you fight against diseases that is the basic concept of it that one line if you knew you could solve this question then other than those made by humans nanoparticles do not exist in nature that one blunder statement is enough to solve this question okay nanoparticles are just tiny particles it can be by human not human whatever it is okay so there you can eliminate one okay then it is like three directly correct so like this it was easy then nanoparticles may be found in manufacture of cosmetics so that also is common sense clearly no this also previously upsc question came like lead is used in lipstick then that is causing problem to environment so like that many things upsc itself asked in the past they are just relating some old questions and making up new new questions in a new format okay so like that you can come to answers with all 2022 questions okay then with reference to web 3.0 so this because in news they asked it okay so again you go through the statement and try to answer it then here the portals arogya setu covin Digi, Digi, sorry digi locker and diksha all these four in detail any coaching class or any magazine you are following okay that's why i told when you do current affair your science get covered automatically these four if you did not study and go to the exam that means you are following some institute who is giving you very poor current affairs okay because including vice ias everybody has covered this everybody which i know okay have covered these topics then here software as a service this was a little bit difficult question because you may not be first thing is not interested in computer software and all these things and they are asking you some details like whether consumer can do this whether they can do in mobile devices whether these are examples of saas so this you may know it or not know it that is why as i told in 100 questions you know you have to write only 50 questions maximum meaning you have to clear 100 marks cut off so 
in that you have a scope of skipping 50 questions also 50 you can write and 50 you can skip also so these are the type of questions if you don't know you can simply skip it okay i'll show you more questions now which are like that okay so if you see this one fractional orbital bombardal system so maybe you have never heard about it this one is about biofilm maybe you never heard about it and this one is about probiotics all these three were in news and that is the reason it was asked okay so if you have not read the news item this like 2 plus 2 plus 2 6 marks is gone so that you know that so that you cannot prepare this you cannot prepare from any physics textbook or chemistry textbook or any standard textbook you have to know ideally current affairs so current affair if you did not do you are going to lose out on marks okay that is the information i can give you very crucial information at the end of this video i'll tell you more things on that so now vaccines okay this is a very easy question because they ask you about the basic covid shield sputnik and covaxin okay and this again as i told if any institute where from where you're preparing if they did not teach you this you are in the wrong institute okay so switch from there okay if you don't want YCIS, don't join but you go and join somewhere else where basics are taught okay because without basics you cannot clear upsc this was the 15th question which is the longest question also which came in 2022 seven statements they gave and told like if a major solar storm uh, comes to earth what can all happen okay so in this i think one of the i think tsunami or something was there which was little awkward so that if you eliminate maybe you'll get the answer okay this i have to again uh, look back the question but this is what i uh, feel i've not read all the statements now so this way UPSC is a one thing I'll tell you the longer the question the easier it will be okay because when multiple statements are there answer will never be one two three four five six seven okay answer will be never like that 99 percent of the case it is like that so one or two statements UPSC wants you to find out and eliminate okay so this is the 2015 question now the final part of this video sources to prepare and how to prepare science and technology so there is no single book as i told there's no single book or specific book okay i am planning to make a book on it but it will take time okay i'm planning to make a book that will be maybe sufficient for you but still i can't call it sufficient because upsc trends keeps changing so no single book for upsc ncrt and standard book may not be worthy of your time okay because i hear many coaching classes and mentors telling take your uh, physics uh, class 8th and uh, biology class 10th then your chemistry class 12th and then some uh, sample notes please do that i am telling you that will waste a lot of time because there will be a lot of detailing about all these things like uh, as i told atoms elements they will list down like sodium potassium magnesium everybody everything's uh, element name what is the number of electrons protons they just they just make it little complicated and you will think like these are all important but that is for ssc and psc okay for upsc you don't need that much detailing you need the general application of it okay or the features of it so where you will get all the thing is the previous year paper just take and by heart all your questions by heart means i'm trying to understand and by heart only just understand okay this is the topic which came about water so i need to know okay water specific heat is like this and water and ice this is the difference and water dissolves these many compounds because that will be the statement which came in the papers okay so 2016 onwards you have to uh, do okay minimum okay if you're giving 23 24 whatever because 2016 is the time when actually trend started changing upsc up to 2015 now they were asking questions from books actually direct from the books but then when this online things and all came, they understood, okay, people are studying everything and coming. So they increased their scope of questions. They started asking various things from the internet, various things from different online articles. So 2016 onwards, question paper, questions are very, very interesting, very, very beautiful, I will say. So you should try to start from there and solve all the questions, all the previous year questions. And as I told, focus on the wrong answers also, not just like, like qubit means quantum computing. You have to study the wrong answer of cloud services. You have to study about VLC, uh, WLAN, all these things you have to study okay then newspapers every information and how you will do how you will know which article to read and which not to read that is why i did the syllabus breakdown now detailed syllabus breakdown i told okay 5g is there internet of things is there or virus is there bacteria is there if that word is there in your headline of your newspaper article that becomes crucial that article you have to definitely read and make notes okay and as i told if you cover a current affair magazine you will definitely get it so join any current affair magazine where they give you 12 months proper current affairs detailed notes maybe question answer format or answer format, whichever format they give you get that one current affair magazine and don't pile it up from different different institutes just follow one or two that is maximum one is actually enough okay then you have to have a test series both prelims and mains and that again i know many people go and join these telegram groups and whatsapp groups and they just simply take like vision is material and throw it on that maybe the tis and throw it on that or shankar is they, they just steal it from here and there and dump it there and you feel like okay i'm getting everything but morning when you wake up okay today 500 messages are there okay good tomorrow 700 messages there but till your exam date these messages are just piling up you are not sitting and reading all these things okay so please see to it that you join one genuine good test series whichever institute it is and take that prelims test and mains test then you will understand that you are improving or not okay so how 
Vaisayas can help you is the final slide of this video and I'll wind up. So we actually have covered almost everything which is required for almost every subject. Okay. So one thing is the free foundation video like this one. Okay. Because I'm sure a serious aspirant would have benefited from this video. Okay. A free foundation video like this one, every subject I'm going to do. Then free science specific video playlist already there. Simply search Vaisayas science playlist. You will get in English and Hindi both the things. Okay. I'm telling the DNA, RNA, GSLV, uh, PSLV, everything we have tried to cover. Okay. And I'll add more videos into it in the coming days. So so that before prelims and all you have hundreds of videos okay so that is going to be there free of cost then free science mcq quiz is there you know plum series we are doing every day in which friday i am taking science and tech okay as of now i am taking maybe later somebody else will take but every friday i am taking science and tech okay like today if it's friday today it will come right so science on a friday uh, csat on a saturday like that different teachers are taking these teachers are taking uh, different uh, subjects okay on different days now Previous year paper, as I told, 2016 onwards is available already in my channel. Okay. And 2021 and 22, I am doing now. It will also complete soon. And prior to this, 2015 14 also, I am gathering the questions and I am trying to make the videos for that. So everything is free. All these things which I told is free of cost, which will be sufficient for you to clear most of the things. Okay. Other than this, we have prelim science specific test series PDF, which we are giving at a small price. Okay. So there are five specific PDF is there. 500 questions plus explanation is there, which will cover most of your things which came in the news also, which is there in static also. Okay. Then there is prelims current affair test series, which again, as I told, based on your requirement, you need last 12 months, you will get 1200 MCQ. You need last 24 months, you will get 2400 MCQ. So like that, or the future 12 months, which is coming up. Okay. I'm telling for 2024 batch, if you need the upcoming 12 months, that also you can enroll. Okay. When as and when it is ready monthly, monthly, I will try to give it in your email so like that current affairs are there so this will be sufficient because last year almost every question which came most of them were there in our test PDF, pdf itself okay then we have the mains test series in which when you join and when you write gs3 test which will happen in gs3 there is answer writing there is evaluation report card which i will be doing myself okay so all these things are there in vishis for the science test okay like this for every subject i will make a separate video and if you have doubts you can tell me in whatsapp email or instagram and we will try to make more and more free, free videos like this for you okay so the most trustable guidance as we keep claiming we are trying to do okay our entire time uh, team is trying to do so please support us okay and tell in comment section how can vice help you okay because you can sit at home and ideally clear upsc that is what i can guarantee you but you have to learn from the right places okay so please tell in comment section what more help we can do for you and we'll try to do it okay and if you're a new person at vice you are seeing this video for the first time just send a whatsapp message upsc foundation and we'll take care of your preparation okay so that's it from now i'll uh, come with the next video thank you and have a nice day